Hey peeps. So I have something really cool. I have um, smothered cabbage. You see that? Smothered cabbage. I have some extra rice on the side. Anyway, so I have um, some smothered cabbage and I made it the way my family makes um, <clears throat> uh, collard greens. The only thing is, the cabbage does not hold up the same way a collard green does. Wish I had known. Anyway, um, the video for how I made it should be on my main channel, but it's actually there's rice underneath it. And I seasoned the rice with only a little bit of salt because this has a decent amount of salt in it. Mm. Amazing. Um, a lot of gelatin too. Like, because I made this last night, but I wasn't feeling well after I finished cooking it. So I was like, all right, let me just let it cool down, put it up. What the hell is wrong with y'all? Sorry, my cats are crazy. So anyway, I'm this one. I'm dedicated to our heart recipes. I love Rosie. I love her creative ideas. Um, but this is just my take on that. So, mm hmm. So, I'm gonna eat like. I wonder if I mix this rice in, yeah. Computer. See, this is that nonsense. Reggie, get off the computer before I spray you. This is why we can't have nice things get off the computer, Papa. <sighs> One second, y'all. Let me shut this down. Oh, come on. I'm keeping all of this in, by the way. One second. You have to look at the sound. So it's off. <laughs> anyway, back to this half food. Yeah, I've got rice in the bottom and I have the rice on top. And you know my new glass bowl? You can see anything on here. I love it. I love it. Look at it. Look at it. These this is actually from a set of Pyrex bowls. Um I'm just gonna mix it all together because I want. So like this was actually saltier than I thought it would be because it cooked down a lot like the liquid. So I added a little bit more liquid and then I just added less salt to the rice than I normally would. Because I knew that once the rice, like once it started soaking into the rice, it would absorb a lot of the um, juices and the salt from everything. I'm hot because it's hot when I'm filming. Um, and this is spicy. My mother loves pepper with her cabbage, so I did add a little bit more pepper than I would if I was seasoning greens. But it has black pepper and red, uh, the red uh, pepper flakes. So, it has both kinds of uh, pepper in it. And this is easy, so I boiled, so the issue out here is that I cannot find up cut up collard, I'm um, cut up, um, smoked turkey ones. I can't find up any cut up, I can't find any cut up smoked turkey meat, so. I got three wings, I broke them up, boiled them in just water for two and a half hours. Then they were like full off the bone. Took them off the bone, broke them up into like larger chunks. I love some of the skin and like, I like the skin of smoked turkey wings. I love it. So I put about two wings worth back into the pot with water. Head of cabbage, maybe two, three pounds of uh, green cabbage, salt, pepper, Red pepper flakes cooked it. I used about three liters of water to start, but I would add an extra liter or two of water. And I know liter is such a weird measurement, but I used. I got it. I used my um my uh, kettle, my electric kettle for measurements. Um, I used to cook that. I cooked it for an hour, but I should have probably cooked it for less because I like my cabbage really crunchy. Kind of my mother made. A huge pot and then cooks it overnight pretty much like she watches the pot overnight I've done it with her I hate it 
Well, adding the rice and mixing it was good. It was a good idea. I'm trying not to drink all this because I do want to eat this. The last time I ate was... It's 10.30 now while I'm filming. And the last time I ate was... Mm, like 4.35 o'clock. So. Thinking back, I should have used a wooden spoon. But y'all, I can't wait. I'm getting me some wooden forks. So hype. And I think I'm going to get me some more wooden spoons. And I'm going to get me some wooden bowls. I'm really excited. So, y'all want to hear Thanksgiving story time since I'm eating this? Even though it's not Thanksgiving. By the time this comes out, it'll be, um... December something, but I'm gonna tell you December. I'm gonna tell you something. I'm gonna tell you nonetheless. So, my mother, what she likes to do, she gets everything like the day before. They get out of work early, she goes to the supermarket, gets everything the day before, or the day before that, like pretty much the day before. And <clears throat> Mm hmm chock full of meat. Pretty much the day before. And then it's like a two-day operation. Or pretty much a day and a half operation because she'll shook the greens, she'll make those. She will run cold water over the turkey. Um I think the mac and cheese she does the day of Thanksgiving and it's done then. Oh, they'll make Spanish rice. Um, and then, huh? I have to go something out. Like, you know, so the things she make, like, those are like the overnight things, and then the mac and cheese. But she doesn't even like a lot of that stuff. She doesn't really like a lot of soul food because she grew up eating it so much. Excuse me. So that's the one time a year she makes that. A um, meal. I love green. Cause I don't like the skin of most things. Like smoked turkey skin, baby. Something about it. And me and my sister, we both don't like turkey. We like smoked turkey, but we don't like, like regular turkey. Unless it's deli turkey. It's the only turkey we like is deli turkey. Mmm. I've been up so late lately, like five o'clock in the morning late. Mm. But I love rice. Rice is life. It's actually a dish I'm making for the next video. <clears throat> but then I'm gonna have this bowl so you can see how beautiful everything is. I mean, not gonna spoil it. But it's a recipe I recently saw. Um, by the time you see it, it won't be like new or whatever, but but I liked it. I am okay, but I'm gonna go. Oh, some pepper. I'm like, what is that red pepper flake? Sometimes the flakes are not small. What is that about? Why are these flakes so dang big? Mm. And my brother always says, you had too much pepper when you make the collard greens. I've made them once before. Delicious. Mm -hmm.
Sorry, so some pieces are just like these huge things of skin. Mm. I almost swallowed it whole. Oh! <laughs> Jesus, I gotta chew this better. <laughs> Give me a second. There we go. Only downside to the skin is it's like you still have to chew it a lot more than you would anything else. Anyway. I'm trying to make sure I get all the stuff because I actually packed the rice at the bottom pretty firmly. Ooh, excuse me. No, it's just. I'm about to be running because it's hot. Hmm. Yeah, this might be lunch tomorrow, boy. Oh, and for things, you know, we normally have turkey, stuffed turkey, so it is with stuffing and dressing because they put it on the side. Um, so chicken, rice and peas, mac and cheese, collard greens. I don't think of what else. We have the cranberry sauce. Yes, the canned one. I love it. I love the slices. I love slicing my sauce. What else do we normally have? Um, sometimes like different desserts, like different pies or whatever. I think one time we had apple pie, um, cheesecake, like strawberry cheesecake. Um, we're not terribly fond of cherry types of cherries they put in there. We like black cherries, but, but those are the kinds of cherries they put in when they make the. Um, let's see. I'm trying to think of what else. I think cornbread too. I feel like we've had cornbread. I don't know. But what do y'all normally have for Thanksgiving? Yeah. Does it differ for Christmas? Because for my mother it doesn't. Because um, we don't eat ham. But we don't turkey. We just like have um some of those things so we wouldn't have like collard greens we just eat the leftovers because there's always bags and bags of leftovers of the smoked collard greens oh smoked greens and collard greens so i just defrost a bag of that maybe a smaller mac and cheese maybe not probably defrost a mac and cheese uh chicken and all of all that other stuff maybe dessert but not as extravagant like you may go get some sarah lee or something you know I'm really trying to finish the show. I'm not gonna. I can't. Like, I know. <laughs> I can't. 
Mm. But y'all should definitely go to her channel. I heart recipes. I love her. I follow her on my main. Oh, man. I thought it was so small, but you know what? This is actually going to make a really good lunch. I'm just going to make a nice little, like, get me through the day lunch. I should just try to finish it. I got enough juice because this is hot. Like, yo. This ting spicy. Yo. What did I do? I think the thing is because I had the bottom of the red pepper flakes. I took the top off and just went like, Doop. I turned that bottle almost upside down, y'all. Don't do what I did. <sighs> it's only a couple bites, but it's not easy. Okay, I am done for real. I actually can't eat any more. I'll get sick. Anyway, I love y'all peeps. I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye.